Hello there, Star Wars fans and collectors. Welcome back to another Star Wars figure review. Today, we'll be taking a look at Admiral Mahdi from A New Hope. This is the Power of the Force 2 version of Admiral Mahdi that came out in the late 90s. And this one comes with a Comtech chip. And for those that uh, do and do not know, um, in the late 90s, the, um, they released uh, Comtech chips for the Power of the Force 2 figures as well as the Phantom Menace figures. And if you buy the com or if you buy a figure that came with the contact chip you could buy the contact reader separately and then you can put the chip next to the reader or maybe on top of the reader and you hear a um a line that was spoken by the character from that film uh i have a contact reader somewhere i don't i have it buried somewhere and i think the batteries are dead by this point so i'm not going to mess with that but you can always do a quick you know search on this figure and and i think some people actually have this one with their contact reader um next to it and you can and you can you know you can hear the dialogue from the reader but it's not going to happen in this video just because of you know of, of where it's at and i guess just for the sake of time i guess but anyway um this figure is not bad i give this a 7.5 out of 10 uh, obviously this figure is a bit outdated we do have a new version of this character in the vintage collection well well it's in the vintage collection but it's in the four pack with uh admiral Mahdi, admiral piet and two generic officers in that uh four pack and even though this version is outdated i still find it to be a great figure despite it's you know um you know outdated um uh, i guess um value i guess and they also re-released this figure in the, I think it was the Saga Collection or Riddle Trilogy, or Riddle Trilogy Collection. But they re-released this figure in a uh, multi-pack with um, Vader, Tarkin, <laughs> and all the officers from A New Hope. And it's, from the, it's based on the scene where the officers and Vader have that conference in that conference room. And what they did was they took this figure, repainted it, gave him a different blaster, and that was it. And the same goes for the Tarkin, because in that battle pack, the Tarkin figure that was using that battle pack, or multi-pack, was a repaint of the Episode 3 Tarkin, and they gave him a different blaster as well. And in the other figures, uh, well, the other officers were just, the other officers, I'm sorry, the other officers that were in that pack were re were re retools and repaints of, you know, other, uh, well, they're not, not from other officers, but, but they were re, they were re, the body parts that were used for other officers were reuses and retools from other uh, officer characters, and they just mashed them up together and gave them a new head sculpt. Um, but yeah, other than that, all the officers in that uh, pack were either repacks or just retools with different head sculpts. And of course, Vader is his own separate figure. <laughs> but anyway, uh, back to this figure. Um, articulation that he has is a swivel head, swivel shoulders, the left elbow is on a hinge. The left wrist is on a swivel, a swivel waist, and swivel hips. Uh, the accessories that he comes with are a blaster pistol. Right there, looks nice. And the contact chip itself. We have a picture of the character from episode four. We also got all of the specs of what you expect on a contact chip. <clears throat> At the back, we got. Uh, Admiral Mahdi as his name and the status as commander of operations aboard the original Death Star. I think there's a typo with operations and original, but it's whatever. <sighs> and again, not a bad figure, but it is outdated. But I like the design of it. The, detail the detailing is nice. And I like how they made um, his uh, left elbow articulated so you can do the... Um, reenactment where he gets choked by vader and if you look at the head and the body he's facing upwards because they're, they're really going for that um to that uh s scene where he's being choked and they really want to recreate that where he is being choked and he's looking up um but yeah that's a nice nod <laughs> now again 7.5 out of 10 not a bad figure and you can definitely get it if you really like you know imperial officers and yeah but hopefully that you guys enjoy this review and with that being said thank you for watching as always be sure to like subscribe comment down below hit the bell icon and i will see you in the next video may the forest be with you and have a great rest of your night bye